Good morning, everyone. It's 525. Want to take a deep dive on so-called dupes, products that look like the more expensive ones. We are stretching your dollar this morning with how they stack up against the name brands. Have you seen influencers touting so-called dupes with pride? Don't go buy leggings for that much money when you can get these for half the price. It's the same product. It's the same it's the same thing. It's always really fun to find a really great affordable alternative to something because you're helping your friends out and you can tell them like, hey, you've been using this, here's this, and then they can put more money towards bills instead of foundation. Anna Pothier is a series on her socials where she breaks down active ingredients in high-end products and shows less expensive options with the same components. So is everything that's highlighted in yellow here is also highlighted in yellow here. Saving money on items is now becoming something that's a little bit in vogue. It's cool to be wearing something that is less expensive, but looks like the expensive brand. And Herzog, who wrote a book on counterfeit, says these products are different from illegal knockoffs. A dupe product doesn't necessarily mean counterfeit. What it does mean is that it is a similar product, but less expensive than the original product. When you're talking about a counterfeit item, you're talking about an item that's pretending to be like the original item. And she adds that it is worth noting since they are different products, they likely have different types of returns or warranties attached that you're used to. So you do want to pay close attention to that if you are switching products, Keith.